Welcome to episode number three of Austin Dundon's NHL 21 Expansion Draft Franchise Series. And today, I'm going to obviously play on my Austin Dundon's NHL 21 Expansion Draft Franchise Series, like they just said. Uh, we're playing the Devils at home. It's uh, our first game of 2021, because it's uh, right now in the game, it's Saturday, January 2nd, 2021. So it's our first game of 2021, and it's the Devils' first game of 2021. We're, so, yeah. The Devils' first day of 2021, and it's the Dead Nods' first day of 2021. It is being played at the Dodge House in Austin. We're 25, 8, and 4. We're 25, 8, and 4 with 54 points, and the Devils are 21, 16, and 0 with 42 points. As you can see, Ryan Strom right there, he's played 37 days, so he's played. I think he's played all our games. I think, no, I'm not sure. Quick math here, 12, yeah, he's played all 37 of our games. It's 10 goals, 44 assists, 54 points, and he leads our team in points. As it's, um, yeah. Obviously, the last episode of the series was a long time ago. There's only been two episodes. This is the third episode, obviously. And, yeah, let's look at the, the player stats. Uh, is that, um, so, Taylor Hall is two points behind Ryan Strom for the, for the lead for the Dundons. Hall has 29, or 23 goals, 29 assists, and 52 points, and 18 penalty minutes, and then Strom has 8 penalty minutes, so it's pretty good. And Hall is a, plus tw a 26 for plus minus, and then Strom is a 30 for plus minus. So uh, let's look at the, like, the standings and all that good stuff. As you can see, Dundons, Blackouts, Avalanche, Wild, and the Blues are in a two wild card spots. Because there's top three range division in this game. We don't have a top four range division because of COVID and stuff. They don't have wild cards. But here, top three range division, and then two wild cards. So you could have five from one division, three from the other division. Right now, that's the plan. That's see the end. Of t see the end of today. That that's what it would be. But right now, be, it's Dundons, Blackouts, Avalanche, Wild, and Blues are the two wild card spots. The two wild card spots. And then in the Pacific Division, in the Pacific Division, it's the Dutch, the Sharks, and the Canucks. And then in the Atlanta Division, it's the Maple Leafs, Sabres, Panthers. Sabres actually are doing better than real life because they had an 18 game losing streak that snapped like a few days ago. And then uh, Boston Bruins are in that one wild card spot. And then in the Metro Division, it's the Penguins, Flyers, Blue Jackets, and the Hurricanes are no other. Um, Wild card spot. So looks like the Devils are. I think they are. Actually, I think they're only a point out because the Maple Leafs at 43 points. So I believe the Devils are only a point out of a, a wild card spot. And then you can see the Islanders and the Rangers are. Ra Islanders are in seventh place and the Rangers are in eighth place in the Metro Division, which is Metropolitan, but for sure you didn't call it Metro. So yeah, uh, let's look at the calendar and I'll show you what day will be next episode. I'm not sure when it's gonna be. It could be a like. I don't think it's on, like, like, next week or anything, but hopefully it'll be, like, less than two months from now, at least. So, uh, you can see, uh, I mean, we play after this Tampa, and, or Lightning in Tampa, Arizona at home, St., uh, the Blues, or the Coyotes at home, the Blues in St. Louis, the Flyers in Philly, the Canucks in Vancouver, and then, I'm not going to keep going, obviously, and then, I'm in February. Uh, obviously, you can see the trade deadline here on uh, Sunday, February 28th, 2021. We play Vegas. Uh, we play Vegas, or we play the Golden Knights in Vegas. That won't, that'll be two episodes from now. The next episode of the series will be... Obviously, the last episode of the series was the, we play the Dallas Stars at home. But the next episode of this series, we'll, we'll, we're playing the Stars again. The next episode of the series, I'm not sure when it's going to be, but it will be against the Dallas Stars in Dallas. So, the last episode was, was against... Uh, was, Last episode was against the Dallas Stars at home. Next episode will be against the Dallas Stars, but in Dallas, not at home. So yeah, next episode of the series will be against the Dallas Stars in Dallas. Next episode after that will be the trade deadline, the day on the trade deadline. Or for like my Dallas Stars franchise, which I do have a Dallas Stars franchise. The playlist will be in the top right-hand corner up here, along with the last episode of this series. Or the playlist of, my of this series and my Dallas Stars franchise series will be on the side up here, top right-hand corner. It'll be the game on the trade deadline or the first game after the trade deadline. I think in both of them, it's it, uh, we play the Golden Knights in Vegas on the trade deadline, and then the Stars play the first game after the trade deadline is against the Golden Knights in Vegas as well. So that's that's the next episode, and that's 
the first game after the trade tra deadline, which is against the Dallas and Vegas, and that's up so my Dallas Stars franchise series. That's up so this series is it is against the Dallas Stars uh, in Dallas. It's on a Friday, February fifth, two thousand and twenty-one. So it's a Friday before the Super Bowl. We play the Wild at home on the Super Bowl, and then that's up so after that will be against the game on the trade deadline against the Dolphins in Vegas, and then uh, and then uh, I'm sad that's a game on the last day of a. Uh, February, after a leap year, that was a few years ago, I think, and then, um, and then the season ends on, uh, Thursday, the re regular season ends on Thursday, March, uh, Thursday, April 8th, 2021, and then that'll be next episode, so, so, next episode, Dallas Stars, or, next episode, uh, will be the, da or, next episode, I'm gonna, or, next, next episode, we'll be playing the Dallas Stars in Dallas, next episode after that, we'll be playing the Dolphins in Vegas, that's on a trade deadline, and then next episode after that will be the last game of the regular season against the Penguins at home. And it's also a promotion night. This is the last game of the re regular season. And then next episode after that will most will be the obviously if we don't make the playoffs opening day of season two or or and then if we and then next episode after that if we don't make the playoffs will be uh, opening night of season two and and if we do make the playoffs it'll be obviously uh, round one game one. Or and then if we make the playoffs it'll be game one of the first round and if we don't make the playoffs it'll be if we make the playoffs, it'll be opening night. Or if we make the playoffs, it'll be game one of the first round of the 2021 Stanley Cup playoffs. And if we don't make the playoffs, it'll be opening night of season two. So yeah, got that off of the air. So now you know uh, what the next episode will be. I'm not sure when it's gonna be, but I already told you what it. And that's uh, three episodes or four of it. Uh, the fourth episode. I just told you what the next three episodes will, will be, and that, that won't change. The fourth ep four episodes from now, I'm not sure what it's going to be. It'll be a game one of the twos and twenty, or game one of the first round of the twos and twenties down, or it'll be game one of the two, it'll be da uh, game one of the first round of the twos and twenties down at playoffs, or opening night of season two. And that's three episodes. I already I told you just a few minutes ago what they'll be, and that won't change. Four episodes from now, that could change. It'll be obviously. Uh, game one of the first round of the 2021 Stanley Cup playoffs, or it will be opening night of season two. Hopefully, it'll be game one of the first round of the 2021 Stanley Cup playoffs. So I, I want to win the cup. I did last year, or I, I did the NHL 20. So yeah, let's get into it. Yes, I do want to send the a our AHL affiliate game, which I think it's the uh, Birmingham Knight or Birmingham Aces or something. I'm not sure. Yeah, uh, we're gonna go, or, what's our alternate of the day? Is it white? Oh, it's blue. Okay, our road, our road is, uh, then in the last episode, our home is, uh, red, our, uh, road is white, and our alternate is blue. I think in the last episode, I wore my, I, uh, I had the, the nuns wear the alternate uniforms, so I know I go with, even if I didn't, I know I go with the home uniforms regardless. Home uniforms for us, uh, white uniforms for the devils. That's our captain, which I think is Taylor Hall. I actually don't remember. So, traditional, length 4 minutes. Obviously, it's 20 minutes, but the title is faster than in real life. Uh, still, still, I'm pro. And I, I, on ice trainer, be dinner. Let's do it. Let's watch the presentation, James Sobalski. Yeah, Tristan Jari, there's one shout out this year and just over 900 save percentage. Here we go. And for the Devils, they're uh, Jolly J. Depp Merchstrom. Here we go. Ron, you're in the Dodd House. And we lose the open and face off. The block. Seriously, the. Beat it. Oh, we beat it by a mile. Oh! Store not. Good pass by all star! So Hall isn't at the goal because he was the one that passed it, but Ryan Strom gets the goal. Who's the limit of the year? Exactly 77 to end the hockey game, and it's one up in Dundas. 
And our goal horn is the Dallas Stars goal horn, by the way. Now, we win that face-off. We lost the putt, though. So, the goal is scored by... Uh, Ryan Strom assisted by Hall, and speed in a Strom, he just got hit out of this universe. Here's, oh, I don't know, Sergitev, or, I'm not sure, I think it's a defense, defenseman for the Lightning in real life. Here's Brat. I was a Vinny might be a pro in NHL 20, he was on the Devils, now he's on the Rangers, because, uh, that Alex Bertangelo leads the team in points with 40 uh, points, but only five of those are goals. I mean, the other thir he had five goals, 35 assists, and 40 points, and he led the Devils in points. Only, uh, the Devils, I think, I think, said they lost their last four games. I said they won or lost their last four games. Score! Tune up and done dons. Pere uh, per per Zach Parisi, I believe, because that was that sign. Yes, it is. 16 goals season, 3:52 in the hockey game, and it's tune up and done dons. Then that's it. That's it. The Devils won their last four days or lost the last four days. Something, something like that. I'm not exactly sure. Brandon's won the draw here in the open ice. Score. Austin got the puck against the ball. And oh! Oh, I kind of bumped him. There's Jack Hughes. Out the Trangela up the wood. A little bit of a break, but it's not by Jari. Kick it out. Here's Frank, or Frank, or whatever his name is. Here we go. Shot from the circle and stopped by Markstrom with 13.38 to go in the first. We do have a 2 nothing lead. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, Granlin got hit out of this world by a Devils player in the corner. Here we go. Oh, you missed that hit. Oh, uh, I did. Here we go. Here's Bozat. Bozat that hip shed into the boards. The Pochet. Ah, I got the putt. Stopped by Jari. Passed it out. Here's Am Amara. Amari catching it up is R Rafa. Ah, oh, Rafa, but that worked. Halfway through the first period, tune up and done down. That was a big hit. Slow to get up. I mean, they only have four dies. That's actually playing it. Bozat. Oh. So, Bozat, uh, I'm not sure what you saw, but he got his own rebound and then he shot it and then he shot another shot. It was eventually stopped by Markstrom. Live play right now. They always have it in their own zone and now they did it the neutral. So, possession to Poach. Somehow, it's stay on side. Here we go! Two on one! With number 21! Bozak! Ran out of real estate and then our players went over the putt. I absolutely killed that guy. It's pretty all the interference. It was a little late, but no call. This chat. Oh, Brat! Oh, they hit him, so he lost the putt. Here's Bozak, still out there. Shot in the circle! Oh, went to the corner. Oh, that was a bit hit. I got rid of the putt. Tit it out, tit it out. Oh. Devils have up the brat. 5.35 to go in the first. Two nothing and done out. They scored two goals in the first four minutes of the Haunty Dam. Here we go. And it worked. I don't know what I went like, right through the leads of a like, Dunnod's player. Here we go. Oh, right, that's stopped by Jari. And I'll pass it out because no one's over there. Here we go. Here we go. It's a two on one. Score up the post and in. Three nothing. Dundons. Bozat. 10th goal of the season. 1621 into the first period. And it's three nothing. Dundons. So he finally got his goal. So it's what? Ben. Uh, Ryan Strom, Zach Preezy, and then uh, Tyler Bozat now. Assisted by Fault and Hall. So Hall has at least two assists. At least two. He might have sit on set. At second goal, Marshall made that save with 3.11 to go in the first. Uh. Here we go. Here's Barry. Over the hall. It did not work. As it did hit. 
I really don't, I really don't, I really don't. Oh, that works. Two, ten to go in the first period. Time. Here we go. Uh, minute 30 to go in the period. And that went out of the zone. And that's offside because he passed to the 17 was already in the zone. Minute 13 to go in the first period. Three up and dead nods as we have an intro and face off. This is offside. Uh, so the, the, the Devils are 6-4-0 in the last 10 games. So I think they won their last four games. Because if they lost their last four games, I don't know what... I don't know why I did that, but there's 16 seconds left. Someone lost the stit. There's five seconds left. Stit it out. I hit a Devils player, and it's clear. Oh, Greenwood was alone at the blue line, but he ran out of time. The shot that was stitched aside by Marshall. Three up and down knots after one period of play. So I think that the Devils are 6-4-0 in their last 10 games. Unless they had a 16 winning streak and then a 14 losing streak, they've and that the only way once they had a six game winning streak and and then now they have a four game losing streak, they they haven't lost the last four games. So I think that's it. because it said they won the last four games or lost the last four games. It says I saw the four games, but I didn't see if it said win, if they won their last four games or lost the last four games, but I think they won the last four games. The only way they lost the last four games the only way they lost the last four games is uh if they had a six game winning streak and then uh, and then if, now they have a four game losing streak because it said that they were 10-4-0 in their last 10 games. So I believe the Devils are on a four-game winning streak. And we're on a one-game winning streak. We won our last game of 2 and 20. Let's stay into it. Shots are 9-3 in favor of the Dundons. So the Dundons have scored a goal on a third of their shots. That's a After I didn't throw one. So yeah, the, shot, the hits are 7-5 in favor of the Devils. Goals are, or er, shots are 9-3 in favor of the Dundons. So the Dundons have scored a goal on a third of their shots. Let's do it. Time to tap, 215 to 147 in favor of us, so not that much differential, and there's only, we only had nine shots. We scored three goals and nine shots. Here we go. Second period is on your way, and we want to open a face off of the second period. Here's Hall. Oh, that's close. Oh, that was a good hit. Here's Justison up, up the win, and that was broken up by Hall. Oh, wow, they did save by Marstrom. 18-14, the Dow in the center period, still 3 up and dogs. Top 10 and plus minuses. We have, out of the for top six, five, five of them are uh, our guys. One, one that's not is Patrick Hornquist than the Panthers. Obviously, the two-time Stanley champion with the Penguins, and they traded him and after last season, and the offseason, this previous offseason of the Panthers, well, I have no idea what they traded for. Here we go, and that, that got bumped. I don't know how Alex Petrangelo got on the, the Devils, and that almost went on our net. Just went on to the left post, or, yeah, left post. Here we go! Oh, it's not by Jari. Here's Hall. Oh, that bump. By Petrangelo. I shouldn't be, if I'm botching it, sorry about that. I don't think I am. That was a good sh sh shot to make, as he used the defender to, as a stream, but then it worked. Here we go! Oh, it hit a stick, I think of, why would, why would, I think they hit the stick of, uh, Marstrom, or hit some stick to make it go from one, one in line to the other. Here we go. Shot, oh, that was a good screenshot, but blocked it away. Here we go, oh. Oh, that, here's Hall, I didn't realize Hall had the putt. Here we go. Oh, darn it, it's 3-1. Miles Wood, fourth goal of season 7-53 into the Senate period, and the Devils have cut the Dundas lead to 2 at 3-1. to one. I tried to, I tried to dive and block it, but instead I did the dive block, be nowhere near the putt, I, I messed up there. Assisted by Bircher, or Butcher? That shouldn't be, is that an, okay, it's not a nice here. Oh, yeah, I forgot they do have P.T. Subban, so try to, that traded the Devils after the 2018-2019 season. Here we go. Oh, that's a good pick but by me, but it was offside because... Hits 11 in favor of New Jersey, so... They're out hitting us, but... 
We have more shots and more goals. Oh, it is love. And our Mia or I just got absolutely tilled in the corner. Here we go. He backed up. Turned it over. Here we go. Here's Carlo from the point. It was there. Oh. I don't know. I, for some reason, because I think I went up on the right side to change my player, and I thought I was still the guy who shot the putt. I wasn't, so that's why there's a die in the corner. Here we go. Closed him off. Here's Bozak. Bozak down the win. Oh. Go to the door. Oh. And then that go in. Sure. Four one. Off the post and in for the die. Not denying a belief or the die. Uh, I believe he, Parisi got the nine seconds earlier. I believe that was Parisi. But then he scored about game time, like 20 seconds later. Off the right post and on the backhand from point blank. I believe that was the guy that, yeah, Parisi got robbed moments earlier. And then he got the punch in the corner. And then he brought it on in front. Backhander hit the right post and went in. Good job, boys. 7 9 to go in the center period. It's 4-1. Austin's unassisted. It is not, so... Here. Oh, Davison not absolutely killed. Here's Granlin up ahead. Here's Free. Throw to the front score! Not even on purpose! Parisi with a hat trick! As Don, our mascot's going crazy. I believe that's 5 1 Don Don's, I think. 18th of the year, 3rd of the game. That wasn't even on purpose. I tried to throw it around the board and said it was thrown out in front. And Parisi was not our. He has an A. I believe Taylor Hall is our captain. So yeah, it's, yeah, 5 1, 5 30 for the Joe in the center period. Assisted by Freak, or it's F R K, I'm not sure. Brock, or whatever. And Granlou not the other assist. Brat with a shot. It stopped. Here we go. Trying to split the D, but that's is insane. Absolutely not. 4 10 to go. And in front. Here's Parisi. Then he hit four. He has 29 with him. Free goal. And that one went around the boards. Then it. Shot it off the dolly or the side of the net, I'm not sure. That was a big hit right in front of the fans. There's fans in between the benches. Here we go! Stop by Jari, and he had to whistle. I tried to pass it out, but they blew it really quickly. 2-11 to go in the center period. It's 5-1 Dundons. Then there's another sellout. I'm not sure. You didn't see that big Orton in the third deck. And you didn't see Dodd right there. Down the glass. Win the face off by Gentowski, but not out. Here we go. Up to Henrique. Across. Oh. Shove in the circle and high. And believe me, at least high. Jim Kelsey with the slide. And oh, 45 seconds to go. Oh, I missed him. Now he's on a little bit of a break. Pets all the way back to Wood. And he got absolutely killed. Looking for a buzzer beater. Across. Oh, shoulder away by Marstrom. Thrown out in front. Oh, hit Hughes, and he broke it up, and I boy sent it down the ice, but that's it for the period. 5-1 down nuts after two periods of play. So, shots are 29, so in that second period, I think the shots were 11-6 in favor of the Dundons, and the Dolls were 5-2. No, and the Dolls were 2-1 in favor of the Dundons. I was looking at face-offs. So, Miles Wood got the only goal for the Devils so far. Per, and on three shots, has a um, zero for plus minus because obviously he got a plus one for being on the ice for his goal. It wasn't a power play goal, but obviously he's been at, on the ice for one of our goals, so that's why it's zero. And then Parisi, three goals, no assists, four shots, and a three for plus minus because obviously he was on the ice for all three goals. And you don't get a plus one if you, if you score on the power play. You, you did it in a minus one if you give up a short and a goal. But obviously all three of those goals were um, even sure. There hasn't been no power plays for either side. Face offs 12 3 in favor of us. Hits 14 11 in favor of them. Shots 20 9 in favor of us. And obviously the goals are 5 1 in favor of the Dundons. 5 1 Dundons as we begin the third period. Here we go. Here's Strom who scored the first goal. Here we go. 
And... Sean, I don't know, that wasn't in a crowd. It hit. But then I lost the putt. Now in the corner. But turned away by Jari. And I just wanted to clear it out to Petrangelo. Here we go. Here's Duff. Oh, oh I hit him hard. He sure did. Saved by Jari. So it's about to end, so I'll see you on the other side. You didn't miss anything, because I'm still on the pause menu, like I was for the final, like, five seconds to flip. Here we go, they dumped it in. Here we go with the COVID, but he got absolutely murdered. But then, Perez is still not the putt. Bertrangelo! Oh, if he stayed there, he's dead meat. Fifteen minutes to go in the third, it's 5-1 done dogs. And that's offside on levels. No penalties for either side. Shots are still 20 to 11, so they have two shots in the three. We have none. But focus on lockdown defense. Here we go. Parisi! Break away! Throw to the back door! It was broken up. Oof. Stop by Marstrom with 13.41 to go. Seventeen saves for Marstrom on twenty-two shots at the end, and that hit a player in front, and he covered it. He threw it out. Seven minutes gone in the third. That was a major hit, and then my eye fell over the hit guy, and then we turned it over. And now it's in the corner, thrown in front, and was bouncing around. And then I Jari passed it out and down the ice. Now, well, we're gonna beat the ice, and even if it wasn't. Might not have been an ice, and regardless, but I thought there would be a dead cut in there, but no Sadar. Not 11 minutes to go in the third. And that, that might be an ice, and it will be with 10.27 to go. Here we go. Oh. That would be another Ryzen. I don't know. That went right by my die. I don't know why another Ryzen with 9.58 to Dell. And that's three Danes at Tampa, uh, hosting the Coyotes, and then at St. Louis. New York's up next on this road trip. Okay, favorite traveling partner. You know what? It might be. Well, no, that's not it. You're too finicky. <laughs> and that was a flat that wide of the net. And, oh, that was a good play. Up to 40. He was... The punt's going all the way down. To Armea. To the back door. What a pass score. Now inside position. Barely at the one timer goal from basically the blue paint. It's Michael Raffle. Not sure how many goals that is. It's dead by end. I didn't see enough. But it sits one. And there goes Jade at Markstrom for. I don't know who the heck their backup is. For 29. But I didn't see his last name. I think that's Blackwood. Because I saw a B. Then it's, uh, I don't know, it's some, uh, then it's Blackwell, well, I'm not sure what his first name is, though. 847 of the Dell, 6-1, Dundons, assisted by Armando and Coco. Right. Here we go! Up the raffle! Same guy! Oh! Armando denied! That was a massive hit. And that did not work. Seven minutes to go. That was a big hit. Now 66. Go, go. On the breakaway. Oh, he sent it wide. But we're getting a power play. They're saying interference on... I'm not sure who they're... Interference on the Devils. I'm not sure where, though. Where? Oh, right there? I think the call first penalty for the Devils or either team. He's mad. Interference at 13.26. So power play. First one for another or either team. Here we go, he lost the face off. Subban, you would think would dump it. I should have hit him. Well, he didn't dump it. Hit the putt, come on. Right, that was a depot. Here's Granlin. Here we go. Oh, sent to the crease. Oh, falls up. Why well, it runs away the putt because that is Blackwood. 
Six minutes to go. Minute 30 to go on the power play. That was a big hit. And Subban's shot, uh, shorthanded shot is stopped by... Not sure why I did that. Stopped by Jari. You know, oh, I didn't realize where I was, but I said I know. So the minute 18 to go on the power play and 5.52 to go in the period. Here we go. He did win a draw the Grand Lid. Here's Parisi, who has already three in the game. Uh, is that a penalty? Uh, it's not. Face offs 19 4 in favor of the Dundons. Now 19 5. In the corner, and they're not clear it. Or. And they, dump, they hit the center line and clear it. It's not a, you can't, there's no ice on here on the PK anyways. Here we go! For Leach, in front, score! 7-1, gun nods! As they score on, a, on the power play and made it 7-1. Power play goal for Henrique, 12th of the year, 14.35 in the third period, and it was on the power play. 7-1, I think. 7-1? Yeah, 5.25 the go. Just by a... For Elite, I think that's his name, and then Bozad, I think it said. Here we go! I'm not such a backhander like that. They got one goal, which was in the center period that, that at that point made it 3 1 to Miles Wood. Here we go! That's a good play. Here we go, here's Greenland! Back door! Oh, that's a good play to break it up. Well, that was gonna be a goal. Here we go! Wide open that door! 8 1 with 319 to go. Parisi, four goals tonight, 19th of the year, 16-41 in the third. Not for the Devils, but I mean, they only have one goal. It's assisted by Freak or and then Grandlin or whatever. It's FRT, here we go, here's Raymond! Or a Dunham's player, or a, pardon me, a Devils player, here we go! Here's Larson! Back door! Somehow stopped. I did a stop and then passed to the try to... Was the Nanai. Here we go. And that way he's got the putt. Shot! 12 save by Blackwood with a minute one to go. Here we go! Oh, it's a righty, so that, that one turn it or 55.7 today. Oh, we'll lose a face off. We did it to putt, though. Back door! Somehow it's stomped by Blackwood with 40, you know, seven seconds left. Oh! <laughs> Dustin's now absolutely murdered. Then guy blocked it, or Jari might have stopped it, and the clearing attempt did go out barely. I don't know if that was in the corner. Jari made that save. And uh, clear it out. 15 seconds to go. They retreat. Here's Brad in the corner. One last hit. And then one last turnover on our own zone, too. Throw it out in front. It did not go. I'm not sure why 14 was backing up. But we win 8-1 over the New Jersey Devils. And, and the Dunnod's first goal, or in the Dunnod's first game in 2021. So we're 1-0 in 2021, and the Devils are 0-1 in 2021. As they'll, ra they'll ra uh, salute by the Dunnod's players, as also you can see Dodd out there in the middle with the Dunnod's flag over his right shoulder. Dunnod's win 8-1 over... The Dunnons won 8-1. The Austin Dunnons won 8-1 over the New Jersey Devils here at the Dot House. Here at the Dot House in Austin, Texas. Third star, Tyler Bozat. One goal, one assist, no hits. Total shots were 34-16 in favor of us. Hits were 19-18 in favor of us. And we had a time attack. We had almost three more minutes in them. Margot Fred, no goals, three assists, one hit. It was the second star. And the first star will most likely be... Uh, Parisi. She ran up, I believe, it was on the wild, I think. 
And then, yeah, Parisi, four goals, no assists, no hits. The first star for tonight's game. That better pass in. Face off, 21 7 favor. Less power plays. One, we were one for one. One for one, no penalty minutes. They had two penalty minutes. They had no power plays, no power play minutes, no short air goals for either side. And then we had 69 minutes of power play time. Because when it's a two minute minor, if you score, power play's over. So, yeah, uh, what I'm going to do now, uh, I'll have to end this video, but after I'm done doing this, filming this video, which will end in a few 30 minutes, 30 to 60 seconds, uh, I'm going to eat some lunch because I'm hungry. It's 1.30 p.m. I also know the Real Life Texas Star game tonight. Stay tuned for that vlog on my Vinny J channel, my other channel, my vlog channel. It's vlog 153. It's against the Wild. Um, I posted a video yesterday of me throwing the Star game Wednesday against the Iowa Wild. And tonight, same thing. Uh, against the Iowa Wild. Uh, yeah, hopefully they win. Because last night they lost 4-0. Well, there, there, one goal should have counted. It was a breakaway, and there was like a scrum happening. Because in like the third period, there was ten minute, ten like five minute majors were fighting because it was just getting bad. But it was a breakaway. They blew the whistle because of the fight or the scrum happening, and then he scored. But they said the whistle went first, so it didn't count. So really, it's sort of goal, but they didn't count it. But you don't blow the whistle for a fight when it's on a breakaway. I did. You might do it like if you're in the neutral zone or something, but especially in the offensive zone, especially on a breakaway, you don't blow the whistle. But it would have lost anyways, but at least you didn't say that you didn't get shut out, but they did. And then, yeah, so hopefully they don't get shut out tonight. But that that vlog will go up tomorrow, which is Easter. And then let's be on this channel, which will go up tomorrow or, or this upcoming weekend. Hopefully, it should go up tomorrow. But I'm going to have to do something with, like, just obviously, they did my learners program. I have to do some driving course online, and I, I have to do 32 hours in the classroom and, like, 44 hours behind the wheel. Or I think I have to do 32 hours in the classroom, then I can get my permit. I didn't start, yes, I'm 14 right now. I didn't start before my 15th birthday, but I can't get my permit until 15, my 15th birthday, which is April 1st. I mean, pardon me, May 1st. And so it's less than a month away. So, um... Yeah, so I'm probably going to start that tomorrow, but next video on this channel, regardless, regardless if it goes up tomorrow or this upcoming weekend, it, or next episode of series, or next video on this channel, which will go up tomorrow or this upcoming weekend, will be the next episode of my Minnesota Twins March October continued in franchise series, which will be game six of the 2020 ALCS against the Yankees, with the Yankees at three games to two, and game six is at Target Field in downtown Minneapolis. Okay, so I'm going to close the board if it's up to the light button. And also, next episode of this series will be, once again, uh, against the Dallas Stars in Dallas in about a month from now in the game. Not in real life, but in the game. It's on, uh, what, Friday, February 5th, 2021. It's a Friday before the Super Bowl. And then we... Yeah, it's a Friday before the Super Bowl. Okay, so I'm close to the board. If you have to the like button, subscribe if you have the entire mom, dad, grand, grandpa, and that don't spread the fence about these videos. And yeah, I'm going to see you in episode number four of his Austin Donuts and show 21, a Spencer Nerd franchise series. See you in episode number four. Need a lot of bacon and dough dundons.